Outside three games were played in the NHL. We will have the highlights. We will also have a preview on tomorrow's Oilers Canucks game. We've got baseball action from Florida as Montreal lost the Jays one. Tom Richards signs a new deal with the Edmonton Eskimos. We'll give you the details. All this plus much, much more tonight on Sports Night. Good evening and welcome to Sports Night. Three games were played in the NHL this evening. Now the Jets. Well, they were in Los Angeles for the first of two games. Now, the Kings come in two points ahead of the Oilers. Now, they have 84 points, which is their third highest point total in team history. Now, Los Angeles had not finished higher than fourth place in the Smite division since joining it when? Well, 1981-82. Well, the Jets, they had lost three to four. Now, they're playing for next year's job. That's if anybody wants to play for Winnipeg. Let's take a look at some of the highlights. And it was no scoring in the first period, thanks to Jets goalie Bob Essenza or a Senza, whatever you call it. He was stoning him tonight. The Kings tempered 11 shots on him. Here, Mike Allison in front. What a great save. He is robbed. Then again, still in the first period. Luke Robotai is all alone. But watch what happens. Another save. Finally, the Kings get on the board in the second period. It is Wayne Gretzky with a pass to Dave Taylor. And they finally score. And it's one to nothing. Second period. And it's still the highlight reel for Asenza. Now he's keeping the Jets in the game. Gretzky with the puck, the pass to Taylor, walks in, lets the shot go, but a great glove grab. The Kings then go up by two, it's Nichols to the shame. He lets the shot go, he's 28th of the season, coming from the point. Crucial Nisky with a perfect screen in front, and it's two to nothing, third period. Just seconds into the third, Duncan will go to Howard Chuck, left all alone, he beats Rudy, and it's two to one, the Jets then tie the game. It's Howard Chuck, again, this time he's sent in all alone, he moves in on Rudy, almost a two-line pass, and he goes upstairs. Game tied at two. The Kings will regain the lead, though. It's Gretzky from the tight angle, beating Asenza. That makes it three to two. But wait, it is now three to three. They are headed into overtime. They were currently in the intermission between the third and OT. So far for Winnipeg, it is Howard Chuck with two. Jones with the other single for LA. It is Taylor, Duchesne, and Gretzky. Let's take a look at the 